everybody welcome back to our mother popcorn thank you for clicking on this video if you are new my name is stephanie so today we're going to be talking about the final trailer of joker um so i'm not i know i'm at home and usually when i'm here i do my little reaction deal but i actually saw it earlier because i was going to do it um while i was at work didn't quite work out here we are again so we're just gonna do the thoughts straight out from the bat i thought the cinematography was uh, just spectacular i really uh, loved it uh the soundtrack that they were using for the trailer as well i thought it was really great um, jo um joaquin phoenix overall is just a, such an amazing actor and i think he's actually the perfect uh actor to portray the joker he's just such a chameleon and he's able to do so many different roles beautifully the good lord knows that we needed a good joker seeing what we got over there with jared leto i didn't absolutely despise or hate him like a lot of people did i just didn't find him to be all that great but that is neither here nor there. We are past that Joker. and We're at this one at this point. So now I kind of do want to see Robert De Niro's movie, The King of Comedy, uh, seeing that that is being referenced in this movie. Um, I don't know if that would kind of give me like a little more insight or aspect towards the movie. I don't know how much of a big, I don't know how much of a role that movie's gonna portray here. I feel like it might have a big significance or at least somewhat of a significance in this movie is why we got it in the trailer. It seems like the Joker's gonna try to get some sort of acceptance from uh, De Niro's character in here. Um, but I mean, overall, it might just be where it's gonna add to his psychotic breakdown. And we also got to see uh, Thomas Wayne in this one, so that's pretty cool. I myself don't find um, any issue not having Batman in this movie. I was um, hearing some people saying, I don't know how I feel about Batman not being in here. You guys let me know, are you like, uh, about Batman not being in this movie? Or are you like excited that this is just literally just like an origin for uh, Joker? Because I'm totally here for it. I love a good villain story. I'm actually more on the villain side than I am more on the superhero side that's kind of where i fall on the scale i know there were some people saying that there was a lot given in the trailer i myself didn't really find like it gave too much i feel like it gave just the right amount uh, but we do get a lot of clowns in here seems to be some sort of like gathering of them i am very curious to know though if we're gonna get like joker's first kill in this movie i kind of hope that we do but it may just be all like a mental deal in this one and maybe future movies if we do get them depending on obviously on how this movie does um we'll get him killing off <laughs> more people later on but i do hope that we at least get one murder um done by the joker not necessarily by his crew um him ordering him to do it but literally him doing it um possibly thomas wayne i mean why not and um if not him then i guess de niro's character because it seems like he's going to have some sort of an impact in this movie for him possibly not a good one uh but yeah those are all my thoughts that i have on this trailer let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought about it are you here for it it's gonna be like a hard pass for you guys so i am looking forward to see where uh, uh joaquin phoenix is going to take this character and of course don't forget to like this video don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet and of course don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified each time that I post something new and until next time I'll be seeing you guys at concessions bye